We are back with Farming Sim, and here's what we got today. We have three things, three major things we need to take care of today. A new header for our harvester because we have a wheat field ready to go. Our tractor, our big tractor, just got a call from the shop. It is ready to go. They upgraded it up to over a thousand horsepower with the new engine, twin turbos. So we're going to go check that out today. And also, we got a little front end loader for our tractor. And our neighbor called us and he said that he had some trees fall down. He chopped them up with a chainsaw and they're ready to load up. So we're going to help him use this tractor to load up all of the logs. They look, he said they're pretty big, so we'll see. And we'll put them in our trailer, haul them off, go sell them for him. So that's a lot for us to do today. Enough talking. Let's get started. Let's start with this. Let's just load up this tractor onto that trailer, go get the logs. And then after we sell the logs, we'll probably run over to the shop and pick up our new tractor, which I am excited about. And I have a few questions for you guys. So stick around. So let's grab our Chevy truck. Do y'all miss the Camaro at all? I do a little bit, but I will say having this as a secondary prize is pretty nice because I love this truck. Especially if it ever rains or gets muddy. I mean, look at this thing. It's literally built for it, so it will be all right. Let's load up this tractor and go get those logs. I know this isn't exactly the most ideal trailer for the logs, but it's all we got. Oh, and also, let's lower this right quick. So then else is we finished our fence. So here's what we got. We got two gates, well, I'm sorry, three gates. One down there, we finished the fence. It goes all the way around our property, around the lake. If you don't believe me, I'll show you, just so you believe me. On the other side of the lake, you can see it right there. Comes around and it goes all the way around. Took a lot of work, me and Hudson worked on it pretty late one night, but we got it done. Hopefully the logs aren't too heavy because I know this is a pretty puny tractor, so we'll see. Let's get it on there. Okay, we're struggling to get up the trailer, which is a bad sign. Let's just, I'm just gonna say that right now. I need someone to ride passenger with me so they can always open the gate for me. All right, we're gonna leave the gate open. We don't have any animals yet, so we'll leave it open for now. As always, if there's anything you guys want to see on our farm, don't, okay. If there's anything you guys want to see on our farm, go down in the comments, let me know what you want to see. I would love to throw in there. I love reading y'all's comments. And while you're there, give the video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. Okay, here we're here. All right, so there's not too many logs. They are slightly big, which is concerning a little bit. I don't know, I'm not too sure on this. We might have we might have bit off more than we can chew telling our, uh, our neighbor that we can lift these for them, because we'll try. We're not even getting paid for this. We're kind of just doing it because we're a nice guy. So if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. See if we can grab all three of them. Right? We probably can't, it's probably a bad idea. But, I'm gonna try. <laughs> can we at least grab one? Okay. Alright, so this just might take a while. We can grab one. So we're gonna mess up the yard doing this, but... It'll be alright. Alright, so we got one down there. Alright, working on the last one. It's taking a little longer than I wanted. But, hey, we got it done. Let's grab this last one right here. The last log. This probably won't make him too much money, but sometimes you got to do nice deeds, even though you don't get paid for it, really. Drop this last one, and we'll strap it down. We'll have to leave our tractor here, though, but that's okay. Now, let's strap all this down. All right, three straps should be plenty. Let's go make this delivery, and then we're going to run to the shop and go pick up our brand new tractor and check it out. I am excited. I have not seen it yet. Y'all have not seen it yet. We'll see how it sounds. He said 1,000 horsepower. Twin turbos, so I'm excited. All right, this is the farmer who said they wanted the wood. He said to leave it in that white barn right there. So let's see if we can back everything up. And we'll try and roll him off the trailer and see if we can get everything off. I'm not sure what he wants to do with this, but... Oh, don't drive in his cornfield. Okay. All right, let's back this guy up. Unload it, and let's go pick up our tractor. All right, I'm going to try and push these off. I know they're pretty heavy, but we're going to try. Oh, come on. Should have ate your Wheaties this morning. Last one. A little bit more. Come on, guy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Perfect. All right, let's just drive forward. Is it good? All right, we're good. Perfect. All right, so we delivered those. Now let's go pick up our tractor. I'm excited. After we pick up this tractor, I need y'all to let me know what first big piece of equipment we need because soon we're going to be buying a bigger field. I don't know which yet. We're trying to save up enough money. But once we do, I need to start getting big equipment for that tractor. So let me know what I need to buy first. Y'all want a bigger plow, a big disc, a planter, 
What do y'all want? This is y'all's farm too. I need y'all's help. He said it's inside. So let's go take a look. Let's lower the back. All right. Here goes nothing. There she is. Ooh, look at the twin turbos. Oh, look at that thing. Oh, man. So, 1,100 horsepower. 1,100. We could have added more tires, but I figured the duels was enough. But let me know what y'all think. I can add three wide. I can even go four wide on this tractor. All right, let's hear how she sounds. 1,000 plus horsepower, John Deere. Woo, you hear them turbos? All right, I'm excited for y'all to tell me what piece of equipment to purchase for this because it's going to pull it so easy. All right, let's put this guy on the trailer, get her to the new farm, show Rufus, and go feed Rufus. I always forget to feed Rufus. Our first real tractor for this farm. We haven't really had a real... I guess we got the 4020 with duels, but this is a man tractor right here. We'll get it to the farm, though. I want to start harvesting that wheat. That'll be some money for that piece of equipment that y'all are going to tell me. So let's get it back over there. Start harvesting that wheat. Load up our Dodge. Probably go sell it and uh, make some money. We got to pay that farmer back though. We got to pay him a little bit increments at a time. So I told him we'll be paying him probably like three to 4000 a month until we have it all paid off. And he said that was fine. So we're going to do that route. Save up enough money also for a field and some more equipment. Especially for this thing. So if we get a bigger field, this tractor is going to be the one that basically does everything. Besides harvest. Alright, we almost lost our new tractor there. My heart sank there for a second. I need to clean off the entrance to our farm a little bit more too. Because it's so hard to see. No one even probably thinks we have a farm back here. Kind of embarrassing. So we need to clean this up. We need to just make our farm look a little better. I don't even know if we have anywhere to place this tractor under a barn. We have nothing big enough right now. I didn't even think about that. Maybe it'll fit right there? Rufus! Look what we brought home, buddy. All right, let's give you some food in your new doghouse. There you go. All right, maybe it'll fit in here. We have to pull out the Dodge anyway, so let's pull it out. See if that tractor will fit. I would like to put it under a shed of some sort. Spent a lot of money on that thing. All right, we're going to take it out to the field anyway, so let's park it right here. We'll leave it running. Open the gate while we're here. Ooh, that thing got a little sideways. All right, we've got to be careful backing this up. Pull forward a little bit. There we go. I love the way this thing sounds. Let's just do a quick lap right quick in it. Y'all can't tell me this is any one of the coolest tractors on Farming Sim. Look at this thing. I think it's going to fit. The cab is the only thing that might hit. No, we're good. Look at that. Oh man, that's perfect. So we got that in there. Let's start harvesting. Make some money before it gets dark. It's starting to get a little late on us. We got this header. It's new to us. It's not new. It's used. But it was in really good shape. The farmer didn't need it anymore. So it was about three hours away. We ran it over there. Picked it up. Got a good deal on it. Couldn't pass it up. So let's harvest this wheat. The wheat price is really, really high right now. So we might plant it again. I'm not sure. What do you want to see planted next on this little field? I know it's little. But, like I said, I want to buy this one next. This one's like 10 times the size of this one. So we've been talking to the farmer. He said maybe at some point. He doesn't want to sell it yet. We don't have the money right now anyways. But in the future, that might be ours. So what do y'all want to see next on this field right here? I'm up for anything. I like this harvester. This harvester runs pretty good. I think it's much really good harvester. It's got four-wheel drive too in case it gets a little muddy. It seems to harvest the wheat pretty good. It does not have a really big hopper though. So we gotta, we gotta offload into that truck quite often. But other than that, it's pretty good. So no complaints. We don't have a disc set up. So that might be the next thing I buy for that big tractor. It's a big wide disc. So like we could have him going right behind this tractor whenever we get a few passes already done and start disking it up. We don't have one, we only have a plow, but we don't need to plow the field every single time. So I can run a disc and do that. So that might be what we need to buy next. Let's grab this Dodge, get it to the field. Should have us a load here pretty soon. Like I said, the hopper doesn't hold too much grain. So so while we finish the rest of this harvest, let us know whatever 
anything you want to see on this farm, put it down in the comments below. Like I said, while you're there, give the video a thumbs up. It really does help. It lets me know that you still want to see back in my day. So please like the video. I would appreciate it. And until next time, make sure you thumbs up, like, subscribe, watch more of our videos. Bye.